What's going on, y'all? Kind of a different angle here, and sorry about the background noise. I got the nitwit freaking welding in the back. But there's movie going all day, so I've had the Tech Life Boss speakers blaring away. You can pair them up, up to 100 apparently. Which that might happen because I'm getting extremely annoyed with uh, hearing action movies all day when I'm trying to concentrate and listen to my podcast or whatever. But that's not the point of this video, guys. The point of the day is I got this package, and I'm not talking about the one in my pants. I'm talking about this yellow thing right here. And then this Packard, package, Packard, what is this, 1950s? Anyway, I got a letter. And it says we've been trying to reach you about your car's extended warranty. Go figure, right? No, it was actually an awesome letter sent by none other than Sneak Peek Alien Space Saver right there. So they sent me something. It says, Dear Classic Lines Automotive, Greetings from your friendly neighborhood Alien Space Saver. We hope this letter finds you well and we're thrilled to be reaching out to you once again. We know that you take great pride in your automotive work and are always looking for the latest and greatest tools to make your job easier. That's why we wanted to share our newest invention with you, the green color wrench organizer, link bars, and end caps. As a valued customer of ours, we know that you appreciate quality and innovation. That's why we thought you would be the perfect candidate to test out this revolutionary tool storage solution. With its 14-inch rod that can hold up to 16 inch or 16 wrenches while angled back. We know you'll love the ease and convenience it provides. We've included the link bars and end caps for the rod joining, allowing you to connect multiple wrench organizers together to create your own custom tool storage system. We've also included an example set to show you exactly how it's done. We can't wait to hear what you think of our latest creation. As always, if you have any questions or concerns, don't hesitate to reach out to us. We value your opinion and appreciate your continued business. Best regards, Matt and Mike, the Alien Space Saver team, with a thank you on it. You know, I'm, I'm extremely happy with everything from these guys. Like, I mean, and, and you hear the beeping in the background and all the noise, but that's not important. We don't care about the other noise. What we care about is the product inside of here. So, their new 16 inch or 14 inch long section. So, 14 inch long rods that hold up to 16 wrenches at an angle. They sent me an example. Of course, they send stickers. I dropped the other one out this morning. I got home and the wife told me you got a package. And I saw it said Classic Lines, you know, Speed Shop on it. That's the business name on it. And I was like, okay, uh, who sent me this? I opened it up. I was so excited to see these products. And I'm going to actually open them up and show you guys what they're coming out with to you know, bring to you guys. So, I mean, guys, if you have any Alien Space Saver products, definitely let me know how you like them in the comments below. Uh, also, if you're not subscribed or whatever, definitely do that. I mean, you know, if you like the sound of my voice and you're not subscribed, well, we might have... Uh, it might need me to create an OnlyFans, you know, if you're into that sort of thing. But, we're going to open these up. We're going to open up the example first. Handy dandy uh, CRKT uh, CEO pocket knife. One of those fun little things. I keep that one at work so I don't lose it. So this is the example they sent. Quarter inch sections, or quarter inch socket rails. So as you can see, it has the end caps on it. It's got the link bars, and it has the link bars for the rails right here, the long ones. And we're going to open up these guys real quick, too, and kind of take a look at each individual one. And I'm excited to be putting this in my toolbox. I, I, I think it'll really tie everything together. It'll make it look all trick, and I'm really excited about the new uh, longer ranch rails. And by the way, guys, just throwing this out there. There's uh, other organizers I did a video on that were in my toolbox. They're no longer in there for a reason. Um, I guess, being that I did not pay for this, I guess this could be considered sponsored. Um, um, I've had several companies contact me wanting to use their product. And, well, quite frankly, if it looks like it belongs at uh, the Dollar General, 
or uh, the Dollar Tree or Five Below. I don't want it in my toolbox. I, I want something that's going to hold up because I don't want to sit there and sell you guys a product or talk about a product that is complete crap. Between the wrench organizers, between the socket organizers, now they're coming out with the connecting clips. I mean, granted, these don't go together. Wrenches and sockets do not belong in the same drawers, guys, but for demonstration purposes, it's that easy. I mean, can you really complain with that? It is that easy to sit there and connect these together like that. It ties, it's like a nice lamp. It ties the room together. It makes it look nice. And as far as these pieces right there, nice and snug. Put those right there. Beautiful. And it just separates it a little bit. You know, it makes it look on its own but together. It's, it's, it's lovely. And that's why I have a wife to sit there and decorate and make everything look pretty. As well, if it was up to me, I'd have a house full of car parts and uh, that'd be it. But thankfully, Alien Space Saver makes my toolbox look nice and together and uniform. So I'm more than happy with their product. I'm absolutely ecstatic about these pieces that come out. And I'm going to put those in the toolbox here in a few minutes. And I like these link kits. I actually emailed them in regards to these link kits, like, hey, you know, how, what's the best way to go about those? What I did is I just kind of, when I trimmed these down and added to it, I just spaced these out where they're sitting right, like so. If I could get them to slide on where they need to be at. That way it looks all clever and whatnot. But yeah, I had them like that. Now, with that, you get more, more of a bite. So, I'm absolutely excited about this. I'm going to go mess around with the roll cart a little bit. And we'll probably take a little hike over there for a second. So, Guys, I'm going to leave this completely up to you. Use your own imagination. But, from that wrench right there to where that empty spot. That, that's 16 wrenches, right? Okay, that's about the same length. Now, when you use your imagination, here's the great thing. With this product right here versus these... Okay, that's 16 wrenches. This holds 16 wrenches in that configuration, right? We all agree? Yeah. Excellent. Now, either lay them back like that, which is fantastic. And you can space them out. You can see the number, all that stuff. I've been doing this long enough where I've got a good feel for it, where I know a 916, it's a 38, you know, pretty much I know where I'm grabbing at, you know? kind of like when you're in bed with wife but you know are you grabbing the right thing at the right time or are you getting denied that's a whole nother story but i know what i'm grabbing for now the beauty with these things which i absolutely found to love why i tell y'all if you're going to order things through alien space saver they may claim they'll hold you know 10 12 14 wrench, you know 14 wrenches 16 wrenches in this case Here's the real thing, guys. This is this is my thought process on it, what I do. I squeeze these tight, push the wrench down. Guys, how many wrenches do you really think you could fit on that rail? Probably a lot. And you know what? Let's test that real quick. They claim they hold 16, all right? And with this configuration, with spacing, make you all happy, it can lay back, all that. I think I can get a lot more wrenches on it. That's why I say order an extra set of clips that go on here. That's what I did with the roll cart. And let's go take over the roll cart real quick. Real quick while we're at it. These are the spacers that go in between. These are the end caps, which I like. And these are, I really like this. The link bars, fantastic. That way it keeps everything, I mean, I have no problem at all with these things sliding around. But with the extra weight, this thing ain't going nowhere. And this isn't a roll cart, guys. I, I move this thing around all the time. But I do like these bars that you know connect each other. Absolutely love it. This is the ultimate for tour, tool organization. I mean, how can you complain it? I mean, you make it. They supply you with the parts. You put it together. It's like a Lego. It's awesome. It's like Legos for tools for men that sit there and serve a purpose and do it very well rolling down to the wrench store as you can see the other products no longer there but i ordered more clips put them on 
I like everything tight and neat. I know this is a one inch. This is probably a nine sixteenths. Yep. So I can kind of gauge as what I'm grabbing. And I have a ton more space, guys. If you haven't seen the other video when I cleaned this up completely, go check that out. It's a few videos back. Guys, this whole Tecton set, right? Quarter inch through one inch, right? Nothing against Toolbox Widget on their main design, the one that they came out with years ago. As you can see, the whole roll cart or the whole Epic is filled with those, right? Nothing against that. But this Tecton set came from this right here, right? I like them tight and upright. We've discussed this. Now, if I want to give them a little bit more space, kick the angle a little bit, I could do that. That's great. But the whole idea here, i put that little guy right there. The whole idea is to be able to fit more tools in. And that leaves me with my wife hating Alien Space Saver because I'm buying more tools and she hates me now. And that leaves me hating Alien Space Air because I have more room. I have more empty space. I don't like that, so I have to fill it up. And it's a vicious cycle. But then again, at Classic Lines Automotive, we promote buying more tools. That way we could be more efficient at our job and have a really good-looking toolbox. So I think with this, we're going to see how many more wrenches I could fit into this and compare with more toolbox widgets. Like I said, nothing against those are fine. But I really wish I would have known about this product sooner, even though it's a newer product. So, give me a minute, and I'm going to put some more stuff right there with these little guys and see what we can fit. If not, I'm going to have to go grab more out of the roll cart. So, it is what it is. Now, before we really look at the results, I just want to show you something. I mean, okay, so all this rim, right? That's where we're at. Okay. Now, we kind of... Uh, one of those things, and, and I'm not trying to sell y'all on a product. I really don't want to be a salesman. If I was, I mean, I'd go work for Snap-on and really enjoy my job. I mean, hey, sell tools all day. That's awesome. That's the length we had right in this spot, right? I think this product sells itself, and honestly, as a mechanic, I want more room for more tools to make my job easier, right? So that's what we have. That's the result. Okay, off that 14 inch rail, guys. If that doesn't say anything right there, I think that really legitimately says it all. And that's two sets of wrenches on one 14 inch rail. If you like these, I'm, I like them. I mean, it's nothing wrong with that. I mean, you know, they're magnetic. They got a missing wrench indicator. But on the same token, guys, I mean, let's be honest here. You're going to know there's something missing out of that spot. And if you really want to be that way, you can take a paint pen, an orange paint pen, and mark it. Magnetic. I mean, these don't slide around my roll cart. I don't have that issue with those. Guys, the choice is yours on this, but I am extremely happy that I found this product. I just want to introduce y'all to that. Like I said, I like the toolbox widget. Their initial design, absolutely love it. The DIY version, there's a reason why it's not in the roll cart anymore. But I highly suggest you go back and watch the initial video taking all the plastic trays out and going to this. And if you want to see the DIY video, I highly suggest you go back and check. And it's a comparison. It's, it's night and day between everything. So... I guess I don't know what I'm going to do uh, as far as that goes. I really enjoyed this product, but I honestly think this may be my new favorite. And I think maybe once I get everything straightened out with the puppy and I can start putting money back away that was spent, you know, eight grand later on the dog between me and the wife, I mean, you know, I'll let you know, you're a little uh, broker than you were. So once we get that back in action, I mean, thankfully, um, I didn't know about this product up until yesterday when uh, my wife told me, hey, you got a package. So definitely cool. Definitely proud of, you know, Alien Space Savers product. I mean, it is completely awesome. So I don't know 
if I should swap the Epic over from Toolbox Widgets to Alien Space Saver. I mean, I'd really like to. I mean, and I really want to support that company. I mean, I want to sit there and give them my hard-earned money because I feel it's a great product. I'd like to go and redo all this. So we'll see what happens in the future. Drop a comment down if you think that's a good idea. Let me know if it's a bad idea. I mean, either way, it's, it's relatively decent for the time being. But let me know what y'all think on this. And I hope everyone has a great day. And uh, take it easy and keep wrenching, y'all.